I am Dr. Sulata Shanoi, Psychologist and Director, Turning Point, Center for Psychological Assessments, Therapies and Counseling, Jainagar, Bengaluru. In today's fast-paced world, we rarely find a person who has not been through the stress and strain of modern living at some point in his or her life. We all face this and many times we don't know whom to turn to. Earlier, we would have our circle of friends or family and our social network to whom we could confide in and relate our troubles and get some solace and advice from. However, we are finding ourselves increasingly isolated and not able to connect with people and this leads to a lot of frustration that's built in because we are unable to vent out or to get the required advice from others. In addition, I would say that this age has its own stress and strain and this has become to a point, boiling point of frustration in which many people are finding themselves increasingly depressed, sad, anxious, prone to addictions. There are a lot of relationship crises, marriages breaking, children who are not obeying or not performing as per the teachers and uh, parents' expectations, work pressures, difficulty in home and work uh, balance, and a lot of stress and strain that one may face. Now, all this may be natural or normal for us to feel at some point in our lives. So, when does one seek psychological consultation? First, I would say when these feelings of inadequacy, anxiety, insecurity or sadness or feeling anger, rage, upset are frequent. That is, maybe three or four times in a week you experience these feelings and you feel the aftermath of these feelings lingering for a long time. Second, it may also be that this is chronic. It has been going on for many years and you have lived practically your childhood, adolescent and adult years carrying these feelings inside you. Or thirdly, it could be something that is uh, interfering in your day-to-day -day work or your relationships and thus causing a total breakdown of yourself, your personality and your identity. If this happens, certainly one must seek professional help and though there, you may feel that there may be a stigma attached to it, still seeking professional help and getting the benefits of it far, far outweigh any kind of perceived notions of helplessness, inadequacy or difficulty or embarrassment in seeking psychological consultations. So we are seeing more and more people who are coming forward and seeking uh, the right kind of advice. First, one needs to find out about the psychological services that are available. Do a quick search and go through the credentials and see about the number of years of experience, training, the therapies that are being practiced by the psychologist. And if you feel that something resonates within you, you can certainly take a call and go in for a consultation. Now, World Health Organization has defined mental health not only as absence of uh, severe mental symptoms such as uh, these which I have outlined earlier, but also the presence of certain indicators of a better quality of life, good social connectedness, good work-life balance, productivity at work and being a responsible citizen in addition to feelings of joy and feeling worthwhile and having a purpose in life. So it's not only people who want to alleviate some problem situations or going through some difficult uh, uh, life situations but or abuse but others who would also seek to have more purpose and meaning in their lives so it would certainly benefit to seek psychological consultations for all of the above. Good luck.